So it appears that my broadcasting doesn't wish to work. Shadow play, got to love it. So, two point hospital. Um, and before we get to that point, welcome to Maypole. Uh, I've uh, used cosplay to cut all of the fields, and the, I'm just going around now collecting the grass and putting it into the um, into the silage clamp. But anyway, so two point hospital. I did do the video, or the the because I don't do videos as videos because it takes forever to upload, and I can't be asked uploading to be honest. So I do them as a private stream, and then I. Um, schedule them for release well um i had done two point hospital and thinking you know i'd broadcast been broadcasting it privately because in the bottom right um it was showing as being active and when i went to stop the video it hadn't been broadcasting and so it was kind of annoying and I had got, uh, well, because I'd moved, obviously, the idea was per per video, it was a, a new hospital per, per video, but, um, so I'd started the new hospital, and got all the buildings in and everything, so, it's either, do I just continue from where I got to, because I didn't finish the hospital before I had to go out anyway, because I'd left it so long, so late to do the video, that it was school run that was coming up within uh, within an hour of starting. And although I was ready to stop and just go, uh, I still needed a uh, you know five ten minutes just to get everything else sorted, just in case. So um, yeah. Anyway, that that that's why there's no Maypole video, uh, Maypole two-point hospital video um, there will be a Maypole video obviously this one I'm having to record because broadcasting isn't working um, so that's always a good thing and let's see can we get up So the so I thought I'd, while I'm talking I would have something going on in the background and I don't believe I've done a video where I've actually been doing anything other than just driving around and theoretically I know I'm driving around now but I'm actually doing something I've got a reason other than just driving around and talking. I, I'm actually doing something that is contributing to uh, the next season and the rest of this season so the I, I've decided because I have the buy bales mod in I've decided that I won't be doing grain fields I'll be buying the straw in for now anyway because I did do straw last year but um, silage was so low that I had to buy silage bales in um, in the spring because I'd bought the um, mixing station placeable which takes straw and uh, obviously you, you know it's not like um, your mixing wagon where you can choose to put straw in or not you have to put straw in on this which was fine you know gives more use to having straw and um, having to actually get straw or, or, or produce straw so for at least this season and maybe the next couple I will just be doing grass and then um, and then in season well it'll be season six then year six because this is the third year as you can see at the top year three of October of year three um, so by the start of year six hopefully I would be um, doing 
grain as well. Because I'd done grain for the first two years. Let me push this up with all the might. This is a T5, by the way, the, the, the New Holland T5. So it isn't the most powerful extractor, but um, don't need anything too big on here. And some might say that the T5 is a bit too big as well, but or argue that the T5 is somewhat of a big tractor for this um, farm. It's not, not really. The, I think two, 290, 310 is kind of your high-end tractor for this farm. And that would only be so you could do square bales if if you so choose to. Um, and which you'd only need, what, 285 horsepower. Uh, we'll get that. May as well. Um, I've got... <coughs> I've got get him going haven't I uh, load <sighs> this is a bit noisy but I do like the self propelled mowers personally and with John Deere coming in as Farmer Dad pointed out hopefully uh, they will because uh, JD do these kind of, um, hot, of uh, grass mowers or mowers that they, they will have something like this in 19. It'd be good if they if they did. I definitely closed the back, didn't I? Yeah, good. And get the last of the windrow here and then move on to the field 50, um, 53. Just higher the pickup. Oh, look, we missed a bit. Oh well. <coughs> so, there will be a two point hospital coming out along with a uni universe sim at some point. I don't know when. Um, to be honest, I'm trying not to do videos just lately because I've. I haven't exactly been in the best of moods um, using a reason to uh, to rant at things um, showing my that I'm frustrated it, I'm not actually I don't feel frustrated which is the funny thing I, I feel normal but watching my videos back and gain feedback from some of the guys from the monkey show has definitely shown that yeah uh, I I I may have said a few things that could have been not said. You know, I, I, I went, I, I ranted in what Space Engineers was one of the videos I ranted in. The editor. You know, so it's best that I don't do videos for a little bit, just until <coughs> until my whatever I'm going through calms down a bit <clears throat> maybe do a moon dog on it um, every time I want to say something not that moon dog puts food in his, in his mouth every time he wants to say something but every time I want to say something just stick some food in my mouth that way I won't say anything bad although the video that we did yesterday went or oh, Whenever you see this, uh, the, video, the, the medieval thing that we did went well. I, that is, it's an interesting game. I, I, I'll give it that. Definitely, um, definitely, a lot more playable in multiplayer. But so was Space Engineers at first. I know I'm ranting at the moment, but. No, uh, to be honest, Space Engineers was very playable at the beginning. It's only since we went to the moon, you know, that's when I started having problems. I, I had a few, you'd, you'd have the server trying to figure out occasionally where you was on the Earth, on Earth, but um, but as a, as a rule, it was a lot, 
the the server had fewer issues on Earth, but the moon it seems to be. Did I collect all of this? No. <sighs> the game where I got to. Um, it's only since we got to the moon that it started doing this, and I don't know if it's the the game just doesn't take into account the the difference in gravitational values or if because we had this same problem before um, when we used to play a long time ago um, when we first had a server and we we just put it down to that you know it was se hadn't um hadn't uh, optimized the game enough there was still too much work to do and because we had a few mods and we had um, um, air tightness on we put it down to quite a few things and but we didn't start again in the end we we just basically stopped playing and the the server was um, I don't know what made me think I'd turn make that turn in um, that the server was cancelled because why pay for something that you ain't using, right? So, <coughs> um, and to be honest, I haven't been on the space um, uh, space engineer server since I did that video, <coughs> <coughs> and I should get back on there and will, but I thought I'd lost the exit at that point. <coughs> Um, but the 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 good thing is is as far as Maypole goes, as you saw from the PDA at the start, the south of the uh, map is the area that I'm currently working in. All of this area, playable area, we've had no problems. We've ironed out the few problems that we did have which was mostly right here the, the clamp the silage pit and um, and the occasional um, the occasional uh, snow mask which there still needs a little bit more work but it's it's in places where you wouldn't it wouldn't affect you anyway but it will get fixed I mean, the my main focus at the moment is outside of the play area again all of those fields done um, for the last couple of um, days today and yesterday I've been trying to get figure out why the manure for the cows doesn't fill up completely and I'll show you what I mean soon um, it's kind of strange. I've looked for X, Y, and Z coordinates to see if there's uh, in the in the parent groups for the cows to see if there's min max movement settings anywhere, and there isn't. I've looked in the default and uh, maps, and they exactly the same. In fact, I literally literally cop. Uh, exported the one from straight from um, Sovnoska and put in and it did exactly what it's doing right now so I took the one from um, Goldcrest it did exactly what it's doing now both of them use the exact same um, the exact same manure and slurry pit the all-in-one uh, unit <coughs> and You know, the it was it's kind of frustrating because there's more in the pit, more manure in the in the in the clamp than uh, actually is visibly being shown. And for the life of me, I can't work out why. Because this is the first time we've had tip anywhere triggers that function how they do. Before it was always a solid. Basically, it was a, a fell plane that would be buried under the map, and you'd set its min and max height, and you'd have it so it just sat just underneath the map, so you couldn't physically see anything. And 
you'd bring it up, you'd copy that value, its y value for that, and you'd put, put that in its um, minimum. And then you'd bring it up as high as you could, or as high as you wanted. And you'd, take, you'd gain copy the y coordinates for that, and that would be its max height. And then you'd basically paste that in, and, or, or type that in, if you've got a good memory with digits, and then you would just basically leave it. That would be done. Min max uh, movement for the plane. You put the plane back under the under the ground once you've done that. Save save the uh, the data, and your manure would move according to that. But it'd be a solid plane, so you you know it, you wouldn't be able to physically drive into the plane and scoop some up from the very top. It would always take from one specific place, and you'd basically just rest your um, the manure forks on the or bucket whatever you used for, on the, on the plane itself, and it would just fill up because it was a it was an actual tip trigger. It wasn't like it is today. You can't just tip in there. I mean, you can absolutely put tip via a bucket into the manure. You can take a, a manure load out via a bucket and then tip it back in. <clears throat> but you'd have to alt tip from the uh, from a a wagon from a trailer or something because obviously that's how the the uh, the tip works now. But because of that, we I, there is no settings uh, for min max movement, and it's not the max height that I'm having a problem with. It's the max width and um, and depth that the the issue now comes in from and I know there's some right the way down this side somewhere was there yep talking to myself don't worry well I'm theoretically I'm talking to myself anyway so it's all good and in like 20 minutes I've got to go out so this won't be a, a long video that's why I decided to do this video and I will upload this video tonight so you should theoretically get it which will be um, Friday should but no promises <coughs> um, and I could theoretically upload it uh, while I'm doing while I'm out and and while I'm at the school and it might upload within I don't know how long it, but I could have it done before I go to call it a night and have it uh, due to come out before before then. But but this is why I don't like to do videos and then upload them because for some reason, well, I know why the reason is because my kids are on their computer, they've got the internet, so it slows my end down, it slows the upload down for me, which is weird. But because they're doing, they're playing their own games, that you know, so. And I don't think my, I think my um, internet isn't as good as it should be. Yes, thank you. Right. So one more load, and then just in time let's go and get him to go and uh, move on to 50 and then um, and then there's only one more field after this to be done and I'll have plenty of silage then to, to last well through next season um, Obviously, the the cows are reproducing quite fast now, so I'm slowly, or not slowly, actually, uh, quite fast building up the herd. <coughs> I've got something like 120 cows now. Uh, basically, I think it's... Three, three cows a day I'm getting. And this is on a three-day 
season at the moment. Let's see. 123 cows. And every five hours. So I'm getting four cows a day. Almost five. And why did I turn that off? <laughs> it's a good job I did look back here. I've done it many a time. I've um, I've I've forgot to close that and wondered why I wasn't why it wasn't picking up and why all of a sudden there's a big spread of um, grass out the back. <coughs> so before actually re reaching your destination to pick up again, definitely advisable to check to make sure the the back is all closed up but this will be the last field that you'll see me actually doing today we'll go and take a look at the manure pit and I'll show you what I mean by that <coughs> maybe someone who is uh, who, who's also aware of the editor and and whatnot will be able to shed light on the particular problem I've got um, It's, it's definitely a strange one. And it, it's not game breaking because the manure still stays there. It just doesn't physic, uh, visibly show as being all there. But it's still, you take some from the pile and the pile will immediately start to rebuild, uh, to build back up because it's holding all that information in the in in the um, in the file, so it visibly shows how much is there. In the end, it would visibly show how much is there, but over the course of you taking constantly taking from the pile to get that visib uh, that that to be to be shown as a thing. <coughs> but I think we'll just dump this right here so then we can start building a ramp up <coughs> and park this on the other side of these um, there, there you go David there's the, the road that comes around the back that you you will see at some point And <clears throat> how much have we got in here now? 265,000 litres. So, yeah, that's a lot. Anyway, to the manure pit. Or the, yeah, manure pit. I've put some silage in there as I always do for the end of the year. <coughs> so, here's the problem that I have is it all builds up here in the center or here rather in the center but it doesn't come to the very edge of where the trigger is and it's literally from this post to this post and it goes right to the back but there's more in here than it says there is or th then it shows so when I take some from it, it immediately starts building back up it's not using the full width and um, depth of the actual pit which is weird and there's no the tip non-tip collision is on the outside of this all around the outside so it, it's not that <laughs> So yeah, anybody have thoughts as to why that is like that, feel free to express your opinion. Um, be definitely, definitely much appreciated because it is something that is bugging me. Um,
18,000. Because of the amount of cows I've got now, I've had to go with the bigger water trailer. Kind of looks wrong with that tractor, but um, it, it's fine. Um, I think that's that's everything. Do I have any hay bales left around here? Should have a lot still yeah because I you know I didn't move I had moved a stack but um, yeah okay um, why is the gate closed so I think that's that's everything to talk about right now I might actually um, do this one as, or these two as hay fields. I think I've definitely got more than enough silage and there's one more field to come from silage. So I might do these two as hay. That way we'll definitely have enough hay to last the year and go into the next year with, um, with an abundance. So if we have to add more to that, um, to that, uh, mixing station we can do so but I'd, I'd pick it up with the forage wagon and drop it straight in to fill it up first and then do all the rest as hay <clears throat> um, so yeah that, that's everything I think so until I guess I get um, something sorted out with it could could be that I because there was a windows update yesterday as well it could be that that's messed up um, shadow play I, I haven't got an update for shadow play showing is there no I honestly don't know what's going on but don't particularly care either <laughs> you know I, I just can't be bothered but be for, for definite go to my channel check out all the other members of the monkey show they all put videos out worth as uh, worth watching so go and subscribe to them hit the bell icons on them so you'll be notified when they do any videos and until next time see you guys later see ya